cancer tarot messages of love for today thanks for tuning in to your daily messages and let's see yeah your daily tarot card messages and these are of love there's an earth sign around you an earth sign that is thinking about you maybe wanting to talk to you they're watching you online this person is um watching you is what i'm seeing mostly here this could be an old soulmate someone you once had some type of a relationship with this could be an old workmate this could be a relative of yours as well or some type of friend this could also be an ex or they're all watching you i also see yeah some of them are really obsessed with you some of them wanting to spend time with you come to speak with you but they don't know how to approach you but they really want to some of them want your time nine of wands ten of swords energy over here in my hand so you for sure, they're watching your social media some of them are obsessed with you page of wands energy and some of them I, you're not talking to at this point in time there's something about a king of pentacles energy so let's see who is the king of pentacles energy you're also working on your money leveling up you may be getting new windows new curtain or these are windows of opportunity for love and for blessings and for so someone wanting to come in and do you a divine favor this person that is watching you i think this person wants to be the best person for you so they're admiring you but they feel like they're like a monster so imagine a ghost or a monster seeing a f um, you know a beautiful spirit that they like so they're thinking oh i'm a monster because this person is sneaking around spying on you in some way um so you're they're thinking you're not you know but they still love you is the energy so they want to come in put on a suit a tie pick up some flowers but it still look like it is being done by a monster honestly <laughs> It still be like they still feel insecure. They still feel like they're a monster. They, they, the clothes still dirty. You can still feel that energy, but you can still see that they're putting out an effort. Someone. Um, this is a person from your past. This person may say hello, good looking. All right. I'm also hearing Rose. So this could be a person from your past coming back because I did see a death card as well. But you are going through some type of a transition right now yeah this i'm telling you that someone is watching you spying on you i hear evidently i hear crime scene i hear the m word um maybe some type of emergency this person they may be trying to pull some stunt in order for you to be free so that you can move toward them all right so be mindful but i feel like you are protected of that this person they don't know they're so watching you and they're like that page of swords is them spying on you. So let's see. We're going to do a message for who is spying on you. Some of you. We're going to do a message on the channel. Who is spying on you. But maybe in later time. Some of you though. Cancer. This is the energy of an. Like of um, the, uh, the mates of your ex. Spying on your social media. Look. Spying on you online. Watching you. Talking about you. Some of them are jealous over a person that you are interested in, a person that's interested in you mostly. This person is interested in you. Like this person is watching you and some people are watching, are jealous that this person is watching you. You know, either one person or a couple of them all see that there's someone that have their eyes all over your platform watching like they may be spying in someone's phone and seeing that this person is watching you all the time on their phone or they can this person is physically around them watching you and they're like looking over this person's phone watching this person watching you like admiring you talking about you and then this person that's watching this person watching you get upset and get in their feeling they start to watch you too but they're watching this person watching you more because they see that that person is really really interested in you this person delights in your energy four of wands energy chemistry this person could just be like a friend of that of the person that's watching you or their their ex but for some reason they are possessive or they're just jealous of you even though they may say they're not interested in this person they're jealous of of you or of the attention that you are getting okay there's also the energy of an ex that is watching you 
and um they don't like that they see on your social media like when other people like your posts other people put hearts on your posts other people put heart eyes on your posts they like feel jealous of that yeah two of cups is the energy because i'm feeling like this person they want to come around yeah they fear losing you this person they want to be the one to come around and show you love but this is a person from your past though a, a hermit energy right they still have some offers that they're thinking about coming back around with you for you to present to you like they're thinking like i wasn't done yet i had plans i was gonna come back no you shouldn't have moved on you should not have moved on i was gonna come back i had plans for you i had plans for us uh yeah but they, they thought that you would have read their mind and know that that what that is what they were doing during a separation or some tumultuous time ten of wands but yeah, there, someone is watching you find new love. The universe and your angels are saying, Cancer, that this new love connection, according to this justice card, is your justice and it is working out in your favor. Someone cannot come back in your life. They can only watch you from afar, spy on you telepathically, psychically. All right. Your three of cups is you. You're moving on into like your full celebration of happiness and love here so i feel for today you're gonna be feeling some type of elation celebration success jumping up cheering high like high vibrational energies coming in to you as i feel something you are working on is like being manifested 888 energies something coming back around that is good for you mm-hmm someone missing you let us look at it yeah someone is missing you i feel like someone wants you the way how they see you now as royal as powerful as their soulmate to walk up's energy they want they'll be wanting to come back around into your life and like claim you they've been praying over you watching you let's see who this is could be a capricorn energy who is this person the person that came to your mind it could be the person that you love as well no lie for real it could be a person that you love is this or a person that you have a cushion or a person that you want to hear from let's see why you want to hear from this person i do feel like you attract some like the energies of karmics with the tower card that want they feel like they have they see your they like they have access to your energy like they think you're giving them attention or they see light imagine this house and light is shining out of some crevice so they're feeling like they're not completely shut out they have some type of access right and so they feel like they watch your social media this person they could have a b in their name on social media they watch you but they probably don't really say anything but they're constantly there so they feel like you give them some type of a access or a view or that light energy like there's there's an opportunity they see there's light coming through a creases if they thought all the light was off then they'd be like no way to get in or whatever so this person they think they have some opportunity to come back into your life yeah so they someone really really want to come back they, they it's like they're giving um they miss you and they think that you've done some healing and level up you've moved into a big mansion like miss like a miss world energy here with the world card as if you've gone through some major transformation this person they didn't believe in you though and you may have turned like a movie star or you, you found out that you're a princess and you move going to this castle and so this person now they they know that you are uh, maybe alone or working on yourself, you know somehow. This is this is these are people from your past that wanted to come back in your life too that are watching you. Yeah, Queen of Swords. I think you're in Queen of Swords energy where you probably block a, a lot of people out and a lot of people just are spying. I want to know what the good energies of love is for you. The Tower card and the Nine of Cups. I'm not so sure what that is. The four of wands. I feel like uh, there was an opportunity for love, but somehow it was taken from you. 
I don't know. I wonder, like, I wonder if, like, a family member took your person from you. I hear mistakenly. So you went through that kind of a heartbreak. And then you retreated, right, to a place of solitude for your healing and well-being. Because this was horrible. Like, I hear dark night, like dark night of the soul. And now, guess what? Someone is craving you. They're, they're sneaking out, crawling, crawling, crawling in the bushes, looking around just to see the light in your window. Because they know you retreated in your solitude. And they know that they did you wrong. Now they're craving your energy. Nine of Wands, Emperor, Two of Cups, King of Cups. All right? This is what this person is doing. This person, they want to be with you so badly. The knight, that's the truth. Knight of Swords. The Knight of Swords. This, I'm telling you, like, someone feared losing you. I want to see if we can get to know who this is clearly. Yeah, this, could, this is a person from your work. Or you met them at, at work. Or you met them walking. You attracted this person's attention. I hear gullible. You may have somehow given in to a connection. You got close to them. Both of you were very, very attracted to each other. Appealing energies like your really soulmates. As if you felt familiar with each other energetically. As if you've literally mated before in a long time ago or something. That's how you felt like you belong together. Okay, that person may be coming back into your life, but you, someone has fears of the, like, confidence. Like, am I worthy of this connection? But you are worthy. I feel like you're coming to know these things because with that tower energy, there were people that wanted to make you, like, um, a, a fairy tale energy. They wanted you, like, you found love, but they wanted you to stay stuck not believing in it. And these people were karmics, exes, old friends, family members. Let's say you came from a, a particular village and you were conditioned apart to think and feel about love, relationships, about even yourself, especially a particular way. I'm seeing someone that has a shame, guilt. That's how you were, you know, were treated. That's what you know. You didn't know that you are so loving and beautiful. You didn't know that you have beautiful eyes. Your hair was amazing until like you went out to the river you decided to go pick some berries and you met this person that's not really of your clan they're not of the village you're from it's like a stranger but was so kind and so real and they told you how your eyes are so beautiful and you're like blushing because you're like because <laughs> no one's ever really said nice things beautiful things around you you know imagine and they said, wow, your hair, it's so, it's so amazing. And you've never, you're like, why is this stranger saying these things? Why is this person making me feel like I'm loved, I'm worthy? And this person is not being kidding. They're not joking, you know. It's for real. When they saw you, you're one of the most beautiful things ever. And you're hardworking, you're, you're shy, you're sweet, because you're out picking strawberries or something, you're doing your work, you're not, you know, you're, you're not lazy, you're doing your thing. This person, I want to get to know your name. You, yeah, I think I know who this is. You may be, meet this person by water energies or a cancer Pisces Scorpio or in the market on the street. Like I said, they thought that you were um, amazing. Amazing, just a once in a lifetime opportunity, Ace of Diamonds, to see you. They never see you again, is how this person's feeling like. And they wanted to know your name. Maybe that's why this person is also searching for you. But you may have blocked them, or you don't ha like, maybe you're not on social media a lot, or maybe they're feeling like they're not really finding you. This person was a love at first sight energy. But you, you, it's like you went back to your village and you went back to the muddy energies. You went back to the, the, what you normally felt, you know, and you were, you would have wanted to tell someone like, Hey, I met this beautiful man and he said, my eyes are beautiful, but you knew that the people around you are too busy. They're too cut up. They're too like grumbly. They're too miserable tower energy to, to want to listen to good feelings of love like that. You know what I'm saying? The people of your family, the people of your clan, the people of your village. Um, but you kept dreaming about this person and they kept dreaming about you. And it could be trouble because they want to find you. They want to find you, dear princess. Okay, beautiful soul. They're looking for you. The connection between you and this person is super strong. 
the universe collaborates. Yeah, this person, um, they're a psychic. They can send you telepathic messages and they see you as the high priestess. This person, they see you as their queen omega. They see you as their empress. I'm not lying to you. That, yeah, royalty, emperor, empress. This is how they see you. They think you are amazing. This person's been watching you. This person want to be the father to your youths or the mother. For real, for real. They see such value in you, lover's card. This person, they've never met. You're their twin flame, okay? They've never met nobody like you. It's how this, oh my gosh, this person is feeling. They're not going to stop looking for you. And they're still working on themselves for you. For you, for the time that they find, for the, for the time that they find you, and convince everyone that you and them belong together. And this person, they're they're not possessive. They're not delulu or anything. They're they just know what they want. It's you. They met you for a reason. This person is watching you, yeah, magician. This person, they're powerful. There's no one like this one. So yeah, that's a person that's watching you also. A soulmate connection, a dream come true, eight of cups, water sign or a Capricorn. So, Kenta Pisces, Scorpio, or a Capricorn energy for you. All right, chariot. Some of you may have options, but there's only one for you. This you're gonna be finding your prince or your princess, chariot energy, the moon card, Pisces, Scorpio. All right. There could be people like many of them interested in you, but I'm telling you, there's one. There's one. This dream come true, twin flame. Like, you will know who this person is. It's the only one. It's the one that has been waiting, the one that has been here, the one that is of your your heart, your soul, your spirit. Uh, the one that you thought of, the one that came to your mind, the one that you think about as soon as you wake up and before you fall asleep. Night of, Night of Swords. The one that you feel in love with. The sun card. I'm telling you that this person is coming true. For real, for real. I feel I feel major successes of yeses. Yes, confirmation, truth, true love coming out in abundance for you. This person is choosing you. For real. Sun energy. They're watching you. They think you're the light of their life. That's a song. Okay? Oh my God, the queen. I knew the queen was here because we kept putting the king on the board. The king of diamonds. I knew she was here. I just knew she had to be here on the board as well. The king and queen of diamonds. That's why I put the king down here for so long. Because I knew he was like, I'm staying right here. I'm showing up. You are my other half. You are the royal, my, my, my wife, my significant other. He knew you were here. He, that's what I'm saying. He keeps working on himself for you. Yeah, he's watching him, watching you for sure on social media. Maybe he's watching himself too. But I know this person, they're watching you on social media. And they have other people jealous of that. This person, they, they're, they're trying to find you. Like maybe they're coming from their village. And they feel like... It's like how you feel different in your village. This is how they feel different in theirs too. So the, the karmics of their village jealous over you or something like you see this person is really determined about you you are a part of their growth their life something that they must have they must experience for so, um this is how this masculine energy is feeling someone wants you back self-worth but i think you've been like asking for more going following your heart and it makes it's just attractive. It's magnetic to this person. So they want to, they're with you. They're coming with you. You may think you're separating by going after your dreams, but they're, it's like they're following you. They're in your trail or something like this. Perception. This person loves you. They love you. That is the truth that we're exposing today. This is, this is not a friendship I'm getting. This is like a recovery, a reunion of divine love energies but feeling like both people have to discover themselves along the journey you are discovering your self-worth your love your connection to your highness and this person is discovering discovering their love through you through you i'm telling you like through watching you through following you through being in your energy they feel like it is not a facade 
they've been around you hanging around you for long they know it is real how this person is feeling is real queen of cups three of diamonds this person they don't want to hide anymore that's why they're coming out they're coming out for you and they want to tell you they want to look in your eyes again and tell you how beautiful you are how your hair is beautiful how they, they just want that they want to see you for of that they just want you to open up and there's so much so much money here as well you may be financially smart uh, or this is how this person value you some of you are getting a ring an expensive ring an expensive car an expensive boat something right divine energies workaholic ten of diamonds i feel like you will never have to work again ever i was about to say looking at the sun card i was like i don't think you're gonna i don't think you're gonna have to work again look joy and then the ten of diamonds came out and then the joy card you're getting a either someone is coming around to gift you a lot of money or you're inheriting it or you're working hard and you're making a lot of money you won't ever have to work again you won't ever be broke and i'm saying this is oh my god this is for real. This is a, a love, love at first sight. Dream come true. Abundant, successful marriage. Soulmate. Twin flame energies. Um, divine counterparts. Destiny. Destiny energies. No one can take your place. You're perfect. For real. Um. Oh my God. I don't even know. I'm going to leave these messages here. I may have to do a part two. Oh my gosh, the universe, the spirits are working for you. I love you so very, very, very much. The bottom of the deck is the death card. And with the sun card, this is a major positive transformation in your life. Marriage, union, successes, admiration, compliments, gifts in abundance. For you, I priestess. For you, Empress, Emperor Energy. For you, Divine, Liberated, Redeemed, Divine Feminine as your and Divine Masculine Father Energies as well on the board. Over, like shining over you, watching over you, protecting you, speaking up for you. This person, they're not stop, they're not gonna stop looking for you. It makes them whole. It makes them love. It, it makes them determined. It gives them purpose. The feelings that this person have for you. Love at first sight, one in a million. They love how you carry yourself, how you think, how you feel, how you eat. They love this person. They love everything about you. Wow. Okay, I love you. So I'll catch you in the next one, beautiful soul. Much love, peace. Like the video, share, comment, and subscribe. And I said I may do a part two. We'll see. Much love.